breadbasket country, fishery, epic countryside, my VW pickup took us to one of the most southern parts of the island, off the beaten track, and landed us here at Jake's Treasure Beach. Jake's biggest it factor is that it's intertwined with the livelihood of all the people living around it. And I'm really excited to find some of the hidden treasures that are around here in St. Elizabeth. And of course, Treasure Beach is the perfect place to do it because it's full of culture, full of people, and you don't want to stay in your hotel room. You want to get out and experience. So that's what I'm going to do. Of course, I'm not alone. I'm here with Ashley. So let's go find her. Hello. Hello. Weekend does, you remember Ashley, my foreign friend, you remember? I don't think she had enough of St. Elizabeth, so we're back. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we're at Treasure Beach. I know you were really excited to come here. I was really excited. We my last weekend in Jamaica, and I said, you know what? Let me soak up everything that St. Elizabeth has to offer. Yes, girl. Mm -hmm. So I checked in with the front desk, and there's some bicycle tours. And I know you'd love that. We're going to meet with some farmers, test out some fruit. So I'm really excited about that. I know Ashley is. Definitely. Weekenders, forward. Hi Hello. guys, good evening. Hello. Hi, how are Hi. you? Damien here. Hi. Nice to meet you, Damien. Jamila. Yes, and? Ashley. Welcome to Treasure Beach. Weekenders. <laughs> Those are the weekenders. Tell them hi. Yes. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, so you're going to be taking us on this bicycle tour. Definitely. Lucky for you, we brought our bicycles. Excellent. In our nifty little pickup. Mm. Nice. Which I'm so proud of because this is like a dream come true. You know, driving to country, have your bicycle in the back. Ready to go. Care Ready to free. go. Carefree. Right. Well, I'm going to take you on an experience. Yes, off to the farm. And we're going to go off-road. Oh, and nice. And you're going to meet the farmer. We're going to taste what is there. And then he will give you um, a history of where he's coming from with his farming. Wow. Oh, that's so exciting. From day one until nice. where he's at now. Excellent. So he's always been a farmer here. Always been. Wow. I'm ready. I'm yes. excited. Mm. So uh, it's an experience. and. Let's go for it. Let's go for it, all right. Yes. Are you gonna help us take off? I would be more than happy. <laughs> That's my job. No, oh gosh. Yes. Fun fact, I don't know if I remember how to ride a bicycle. I'm not sure if I remember either, so, so it's gonna be a fun little experiment. Um, this should be fun. Okay. It will be. For our safety tips, you know, we stay on the left, two bicycle length path, you know, you never know. Space is good for correction, yes. if there's a okay. pothole or I'm anything like that. I'm gonna need that because, I really, right. no, honestly, I don't know if I'm about to do this. You will, you will learn shortly. And we have to ensure that, you know, we put our helmets on. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Um, I have a big head, you see, so. And pigtails. Team big head. They're adjustable, so. All right. All right. Let me help. Do we look safe and secure? Yes. I'm feeling safe. There you go. All right. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Is this it? Does it That's just... it, because it's, it's tightened here already. OK. You don't need to always have it tightened right it, here. Is it supposed to snap? Yeah, it's supposed to. There we go. OK. All right, thanks. Let's go and have a wonderful experience, you know, on the on the red cycle tours. Red cycle tours? Yes. Mm. Weekenders, red cycle tours. Yes. Check out, look forward for Damien. Yes, for Damien. <laughs> All right. All right. So, kind of um, nervous. You don't need to be. All right, okay. Um, shall we? I don't sure. know, I can't do this. <laughs> Weekenders, no. let's really get into Sinti. Let's go. Come on, guys, let's go and have fun. All right. And have an experience. <laughs> so my hands are like cramped up. It's like, look, they're red. Over here, Damien. 
We are here. We are rich. Oh. Yes, we are at Wagi's farm. Yeah. Wagi, Look at is that you? Time melon. for some fruits. Coming to look at this, it's made me so much happier. It's beautiful melon, my favorite fruit. Wagi, you're going to tell us about this farm, tell us about what you do, and please, let me taste some of your melon. <laughs> We can just look, there's a windmill. I support 100% natural energy like that, you know? So I'm very happy to see that. They're huge. St. Elizabeth, you know, on a whole, is one of the number one farming area in Jamaica. Mm -hmm. You know, and we have fishing, farming, and no tourism. It's a beautiful combination, and I think going into the grassroots part of it, meeting the farmer, meeting the fisher, you know, meeting the historians, Everything adds up to what? Yeah. Centre is the experience. Just the experience. That's just what the weekend is about. Yes. Weekenders. Yeah. Hotel is nice, but it's when you come out and you, you experience what the countryside really has to offer. That's when you get the full feeling. You know, you're not a true weekender till you taste a watermelon on a farm. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> mm. What's your daily routine like with these melons? After them go, we spray them every eight days. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it take eight to ten weeks to harvest. Really? Yeah. So how much melon do you get it per year? I just reap some melon. Mm -hmm. Maybe about 80,000 pounds. 80,000 pounds of melon? Yeah. So hold on, I can get 1,000 pounds? <laughs> well, they're all finished now. They're finished? They're all finished. But I see some little melons. Well, those, those are like little melons. Them left in the field like... People passing through and need a melon. Oh, then could, yeah, then could Seriously? have it. Yeah. That is like true community. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I now feel like I come from Senti. Yeah, yeah. I kind of look yeah. like I come from Senti. Yeah, man. Yeah, true, true. Anybody see you would say you come from Senti. I feel like I come yeah. from Senti. I'm a friend that comes from Senti. Pretty, you know? pretty brown girls like you, a lot of them in Senti a little bit. You know, I even have two daughters. You have two daughters and they're pretty and yeah. brown. Like, yeah, man, they're pretty same like you in that university right now. One study law, one study medicine. And is your melon business that put them there? It is, the melon business. You see that? Yeah. I really... They appreciate me so much when they come and see, see what I do to keep, to keep them up. Yeah. Among the rich kids them at the university, they, they say, Daddy, we feel proud, proud of you. Proud of you. Yeah. I feel proud of you. Yeah. <laughs> now that we're feeling refreshed, I think we need to stretch out our limbs from that bicycle ride. We're gonna go do some yoga on the deck at Jake's. I'll see you there. Weekenders, you hear that? That ocean sound. After a long day of biking through the countryside, eating watermelon, I don't know if I want to go back into town. Actually, we don't have to go home. We can stay, let's stay. All right. Oh, she's down, we can just rest <laughs> in. I really just think we should wind down now. And that's why we're here with Empress Tandy Wise. And she's gonna show us some yoga poses in a moonlight yoga session. Take a big breath in. Come in on your knees, inhale. Roll the shoulders back. And just close the eyes for a few moments. Another big breath in. And then exhale. Another one in. Inhale up. Inhale the hands all the way up. Open up the eyes. And then as you exhale, bring all that wonderful energy into yourself that you're creating. Inhale, send it up. Exhale, bring it back down. Ground the body. We're going to come onto all fours, coming into our tabletop. Take a big breath in. Inhale, look at the hands between the hands. We're gonna step the left leg forward. End in the day, coming into our warrior pose. Victorious at the end of your day. Weekenders, while I settle into this warrior pose, let's check out what Kez Namdi is doing this weekend on my weekend. Namaste. The Weekender is sponsored by KFC, ATL Automotive, Wicon, Scotiabank, and the iCrate Institute at UCC. 